She blocks the way. Can we talk? Nope. Guess I have to spare her. I'm gonna spare the hell out of you. Oh, I have to start over from the start. Maybe leaving wasn't a good idea. Ow. Are you going to kill me? Like, seriously? Y you you want to keep me from dying, but you're gonna kill me. Mm. Ow. Attack or run away. But you're the one who taught me not to do that. I'm proving that I can't spare people. Wait, is she avoiding me? She's avoiding me now. Isn't she? Yeah. Everything's going away from me. She doesn't really want to hurt me. She's just trying to scare me into staying, I guess. Stop it. Stop looking at me that way. Stop giving me despairing eyes! Toriel prepares magic attack. That's all she does, though. Go away. Well, you just... You were, weren't you trying to keep me here? Now you want me to go away? Looks for you. She looks sad. I get the feeling that there must be more to it than just that. I mean, she wanted to be a teacher, but... Oh. I know you want to go home, but... Please, go upstairs now. I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we do not have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? I get the feeling that there's maybe more to it than just losing random kids she just met. Maybe she had a child that she lost at some point, and every child that co goes by here and dies out there reminds her of that or something like that. Please go upstairs. Maybe we'll find out as I play further in the, in the game. Oh, she looks so sad. She looks upset. Oh, aha. Uh -huh. Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. Hmm. Well, maybe if you uh, turned off the prophetic dreams that tell me to go out in the bedroom, <laughs> you know, maybe your kids would stop leaving. No, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave these ruins, you will not I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Oh, hug. Goodbye, my child. One last look. Goodbye. can come back. Why did they say that it was a one-way thing? So long as she doesn't lock the door, I should be able to come back, right? 
What's going on with the floor? You. I know you. You're from the start of the game. Clever. Very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. Oh, that face. You spared the life of a single person. Hee hee hee. Actually, yeah, I think I spared every monster I've encountered up to now. I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die, and you'll die, and you'll die. Until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Probably. Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it? You... I don't think you can do that. I am the prince of this world's future. No, you're just a flower. <laughs> don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't regicide. That is killing royalty. This is so much more interesting. Ugh, that's your face. You're creepy. Can I leave? Can I fart here? I fart in your general direction. So I guess the flower can travel through the ground? Oh yay. <laughs> I reached the... the title. <laughs> oh. Well, there's already more going on that, than there was in the... Oh, I guess I can't go back. I guess Toriel wasn't kidding when she said... Oh, can, can I call her? <coughs> Dialing? Nobody picked up. Oh. Maybe she's angry. Or sad. What was that? Why are all the trees dead? Something move? What the? What is that? Keep moving! Human! Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Uh... What are you? <laughs> 